how to go ahead and change the tempo of a piece of music without affecting its pitch. So let's go ahead and learn how to do that right now. Now the very first thing you're going to want to do is make sure that you have a piece of audio that you want to modify. In this case, I have Phoenix is trying to be cool, the Chainsmokers remix. Now I'm only going to use the intro just for the uh, simple purpose of this video, but of course if you brought in a large mp3, a full song, 4 or 5 minutes or however long it is, it'll uh, this a little trick right here will work for it anyways. Uh, so let's go ahead and the very first thing you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go ahead and check the BPM of this uh, piece of audio so that you know where you want to change it to. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and jump to our BPM counter which I already have pulled up. Uh, if I didn't all I would do would uh, all I would do is simply go to our metering and go to BPM counter and go to stereo. I've already analyzed this in the past, so it, it let me know that the BPM is 128. But let's go ahead and hear how, uh, or see how this thing analyzes anyways. Let's go ahead and bring this back up. And we're gonna hit play, and it's gonna analyze uh, right before our eyes. So we have a pretty good understanding that the BPM is 128 and the way this actually works, I'm going to double click on this uh, or you can uh, simply just uh, 